Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video from the Palestinian school in Qatar. This is Mr. Abdullah Sharab. And today, inshallah, we will continue talking about the sixth grade English for Palestinian students. Oh. Unit 10, the last two periods in this unit, a visit to the Dead Sea. Period 7, period 8, please open your box, page 10 and 11. These are our pages, and today, inshallah, we will do the first and the second activity from period 7 and the first activity from period 8, the system. First activity, write correct sentences. We should write these sentences correctly. We have to use punctuation marks, capital letters, full stops, and also the apostrophe. Okay, let's do the first one. Have you ever been to an oasis? The first thing you have to decide, is it a question or an answer or a sentence? It's a question. Let's start with the helping verb. So, we will capitalize the H and we will put a question mark at the end of the question. Very good. Let's see the answer. Yes, I have. I've seen palm trees and a spring. There are lots of corrections here. Capitalize the Y, put comma, capitalize the I, put full stop, capitalize the I again, put apostrophe, don't forget the apostrophe. And at the end, you should watch. Pause the video, please. Do the second question and sentence, and then check your answer. Okay. These are the answers. Check your answer. And be careful when you answer this question. You have to correct all the mistakes. Capitalize the apostrophes, the commas, the follow stops, and all other things. Let's move to the second activity. Think and write sentences about your friends. We have here a table. Names of friends, Ben and Hoda. And we will add two of our friends' names here. Let's do the, the model here. Ben has eaten five ice creams. Hoda hasn't eaten five ice creams. These are answers for this, this question. Have you ever eaten five ice creams? Ben, tick. So, Ben has eaten five ice creams. What about Hoda? Hoda cross. So, we we'll write, Hoda hasn't eaten five ice creams. Excellent. Ask the second question. Have you ever scored three goals, Omar? Uh, sorry, Ben. Have you ever scored three goals, Ben? Cross. So, he hasn't. What about Hoda? Have you ever scored three goals, Hoda? Tick. So, he has. Let's write a sentence. Ben hasn't scored three goals. Hoda has scored three goals. Excellent. Let's ask two of our friends. Oma and Ali. Oma, have you ever eaten five ice creams? Yes. Ali, have you ever eaten five ice creams? No. Let's try the sentence. Oma has eaten five ice creams. Ali hasn't eaten five ice creams. Okay, let's ask the second question. Oma. Have you ever scored three goals? No. Ali, have you ever scored three goals? Yes. Let's form the sentence. Can you pause the video and then check your answer? Okay. Omar hasn't scored three goals. Ali has scored three goals. Think and write sentences about your pictures of interesting animals or places. You can do this as a homework. Try to look for a nice picture for a desert animal. 
download it from the internet and print it and put it in your notebook and write some notes about it okay about the gazelle about the jiboa whatever write short notes about these pictures let's move to the first activity in period a read and complete the sentences check your spelling it's an easy question i'll do the first one and then you will pause and do the task and then check your answer have you ever been look at the picture have you ever been below sea level the dead sea has very salty water now do the rest and then check your answer you put the mud from the dead sea on your skin have you ever seen a man do this three have you seen an have you ever seen an oasis have you ever been like that what do you think have you ever been anywhere like that very good you see the fourth picture what is this in an oasis you can see what are these palm trees and a spring very good the fifth picture plants can grow between rocks in the desert and the last one the jiboa and the gazelle are space animals the jiboa and the gazelle are desert animals very good check your answer correct any mistakes the dictation the teacher inshallah will do this activity with you in the class please get ready Get all these words correctly and when you come to school you have to be sure that you can write any words from these words thank you for it for attending this thanks for attending goodbye and see you next time with unit 11 exciting thing to do